announced herself as a state league heavyweight with two strong wins at the incinerator. The Heat was happy with the victory over Bathurst, but revenge against Canberra was even sweeter. The Heat didn't know what to expect from rivals Bathurst in their first meeting of the season, but when big man Scott Hare took a steal, he soon found out they'd be doing anything for a win. <laughs> Hare refused to get involved in the needle and found it better to let his shooting do the talking on his way to 14 points for the game. <laughs> the gold miners battled bravely to stay with the Heat early on. However, they were simply outclassed, the Heat doing everything to take control of the game. Enter coach Eric Olsen. Olsen for three! With 32 points in just 26 minutes, Olsen inspired his team and the crowd to a big lead. <laughs> His teammates took notice. Joe Howard unlucky not to add this block to his 15 rebounds. Point guard Bobby Tyre also running him up. Passes like this, helping him to a triple-double. A big 89-56 win, an important one for the home side, giving them time to rest before they backed up against Canberra. We knew that our, our bench could step up and, and play most of the game on Saturdays, giving our, our starting five a good rest, coming fresh into, into Sunday's game, and they did exactly that. Suffering their only loss of the season to the Gunners, the Heat admit they were looking for revenge. Really, it was a revenge match against Canberra. So for us, we wanted to come out and really show them what we had uh, and what we were missing that first night. And they definitely got it with a 102-74 thrashing. Also, once again, the star of the show with an untouchable 38 points. Scott Hare and Bob Tyre both recording double-doubles. Olsen full of praise for his point guard. But it's never easy, triple-double, to you know, have a night like that where he played very well. He dictated the point guard spot, no doubt. The Heat travelled to Goldwyn this weekend for a clash with the Bears. Tim Robinson, Win News.